Hello, everybody! Hi, guys. So we went to Trader Joe's. Well, I went to Trader Joe's. She went to Trader Joe's, so I get to be genuinely surprised. <laughs> and I'm super excited about some of the stuff I found because I found some new stuff. So have you ever been to Trader new, Joe's? New stuff that you can have? Wow, that is great. Have you been to Trader Joe's before? Well, I've walked through the stores a bit. <laughs> no. I like to go there, and they got some of my favorite things, and they got some new things to try too. So what? What? What do you like there? Uh, I'll show you. Okay. Hold on. We'll be right back. Start with savory or sweet? Savory. <laughs> savory. You like how I'm like, savory. Start with savory. I was wondering. All what, right. I wonder what that hand was up my butt for. <laughs> <laughs> savory. Savory. Say it. Savory. Okay. So, my very favorite thing to get at Trader Joe's, simple, simple, is these seaweed snacks because. Most seaweed snacks out there have sesame oil. I was going to say some some poisonous gluten, MS, MSPO, QP, whatever. And I can't have sesame oil. She can't. So do you like to eat seaweed? Yeah, I've had it in sushi. So I like I've to make had just like... Some snacks rice and veggies and then make my own little sushi burritos so try it here try mm. i love it take a bite take a bite bite it mm. just shove it all in your mouth all at once <laughs> that's what she said all right that's what i told her do you like them mm, yeah good i got, you know, I, I've had seaweed, some seaweed snack, and yeah, they, they've got some flavor. It's just not the fishy taste to them. You could just eat them? Mm-hmm. All right, next, we're going to try some hot sauces. My favorite. Hot so, sauces! There's a spoon. So the first one I got is Trader Joe's version of sriracha. A.K.A. cock sauce. And since I needed some, I thought... Might as well. I'm sure it's gonna taste the same, but you never know. A piece of seaweed stuck the roof of my mouth. Uh huh. Or some peanut butter. Yeah, watch her fill my spoon up. Hey, that's enough. Sriracha's not that hot. Tell you what, give me one of your seaweed things. No, we gotta eat taste alone first. Sweeter. Mm -hmm. It's got a little bit more sweetness to it. All right. They also had a green version. So we'll see which one we like the best. You got the heat out I of your mouth. I don't think I've ever. You got the heat out of your mouth on the red one for first? Yeah. I don't think I've ever just ate sriracha without anything though. So it's not exactly. You just sit there and squeeze. And after this video, I might have to go try it and make see. Like you would with the canned whipped cream or canned cheese. Okay, this up. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Not as sweet. I like it. It's not as hot either. It's like a verde. It is good. That is good. I actually think I like this better than the. This one's red jalapeno. One. What's that one got? The red one say is habanero. Red, pe red peppers. Red. Oh, Anaheim peppers and jalapeno peppers. Mm hmm. All right, then I got another one for you. Ooh. Habanero. You guys remember our habanero experience? Remember that? Oh, the one in, are you talking about the one in New Orleans? No, when we were eating raw habaneros. 
Remember? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, it will be easy. And worst, I had you totally faked out. Worst experience. <laughs> I will never ever do that again. I don't know if we did that we for. I didn't know if we did it for YouTube or Facebook. I'll have to find it. <laughs> that will definitely be a throwback Thursday in the making. You won't remember it by the time it comes back up one way or the other. But I had taken the taken my piece and threw it into my mouth and was holding it up here in the cheek of my. Mmm, mmm, that's good. He's a mm. brat. <laughs> and she's like. Who the heck are you? I had not, I wasn't even actually chewing it at the time. He is a brat. <laughs> but I had her fooled. Oh, you need to do it. Don't forget it. That's why you married me. So you could open up jars and bottles. Of course. <laughs> This might be your morning hot sauce. What are you with my egg bites? It's thick. There it is. Oh, that's going to be way <coughs> too much. I'll, I'm just going to do a little dabble do me. Oh! <laughs> that's too much. It's hot. I can already smell it. It's got a sweet taste to it. You're a liar. And I taste better <laughs> off your leggings. <laughs> mm -mm. It's not hot. I didn't say it wasn't hot. I just said it's got a sweet taste to it. Ew, it's gross. Mm. Okay. We know water doesn't really kill that. Next, this I one. got these veggie and flaxseed corn tortillas. And then I got some green salsa. My nose is dark and run. Uh -huh. So I am a green salsa person. I love a birdie. I need a couple of these chips just to heat my mouth. Okay, let's try a chip without anything. Just like a chip. Very organic. Mm hmm. Okay. Mmm. That's good. really good. No, we're not double dipping. It's okay if we do, it's ours. I'm a chips and salsa person. Like, Me too. If they said, here's some candy, or, here, or here's some chips and salsa, and you can only choose one for the rest of your life, what kind of candy? I would definitely choose chips and salsa. What kind of candy are we talking about? I think this one over here was uh, denied candy as a child because craziness. All right. If we're talking taffy, hands down, I'm taking the Where's your glass behind you? So this next thing I got is an almond milk matcha. You know what matcha is? Mm -mm. It's green tea. Oh, okay. So I saw this and I thought, I like matcha. Which Let's is coming see. from a woman who used to say that tea was nothing tasting like dirty grass. It still does. But if I had to choose between matcha and tea, I would choose matcha. We're gonna share. Good. It's 
tastes like green tea and gr green tea gr uh, milk. Grass Which is milk. good because the almond milk has helped cutting the habanero in my mouth. <laughs> I thought you liked hot. I didn't say I didn't, but it's cutting. The, I'm still getting the tingles from the heat. It's not very sweet. Mm -mm. Would I buy it again? Probably not. You can probably make it. Probably. She's, right. a, she's a down home do it yourself or makes her own almond milk, kombucha. Yeah. Well, because one day we're going to have to make all our things. Might as well start now. All right. So I've been uh, craving peanut butter and jam sandwiches. Uh, but I tend to like lower sugar, no sugar, but no sugar jam is gross. So I There's saw not this. not much flavor to it. Low sugar apricot. You say apricot or apricot? Do you say April or April? <laughs> April. Apricot. A apricot. 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 April. Apricot. So organic reduced sugar apricot preserves. <laughs> it's not often I catch your own girl like that. What's the difference between preserves and jam? Uh, I think the fruit. Little. That is little. Diabetic little. Hey. Mmm. Not good. Good thing this is mine, huh? <laughs> Preserves are more about the fruit than the additives. Yeah. All right. Can't go to Trader Joe's without getting cookie butter. Cookie butter. Have you ever had cookie butter? Uh-uh. I've had This is Nutella. a big thing for cookie butter. I ended up getting the crunchy cookie butter because... Crunchy is always better. I'm more of a crunchy peanut butter than a... Let us know down below. Are you creamy or chunky when it comes to peanut butter or cookie butters or... So, you know the Biscoff cookies that you get on the airplanes? Biscottis? Yeah, it's supposed to taste like that. It does. <laughs> you know what the next taste test is going to be? What? Grab those apricots. Uh uh. Preserves. Mmm. <laughs> this is just a taste test. <laughs> oh, oh, that's almost better than Nutella. <laughs> I think I'd rather have this more than Nutella. Seriously, grab your preserves out and uh -huh. try them together. Okay. Little piggy. Hold mine. That's what she said. Hold mine. Nah. You heard her. She said it. Hold mine. <laughs> you won't let me. You won't let me do it. <laughs> I'm no dummy. I saw you married. <laughs> Better on its own. Mm -hmm. Ding. All right. It's almost like when you have something sweet and then eat an orange, how it, orange is a little bit more bitter. Yeah, true. So, what is your very favorite thing to get at Trader Joe's? What's one thing, like, I'm going to go to Trader Joe's just to get that, besides alcohol. Because in Utah, you, you cannot get alcohol not at even Trader wine. Joe's. Nothing. Because we have weird, crazy laws here. So, this last thing that I got, I'm super excited about. I pray it doesn't let me down. Because it's not time for these in fresh yet but i got some watermelon jerky, jerky. and the only ingredients is organic watermelon well that means you could probably just make it in our air air dryer or dehydrator i've made that before though and it didn't work because it so has so much water <laughs> watermelons are like 90 percent water so i am praying this tastes so good if we can get into it. Yes. 
We may need to go get scissors. I cut it along the dotted line. Sometimes you gotta go outside the box. We got it! Oh, there's only one piece. Oh there. no! <laughs> Plastic, it's plastic wrapped. Oh, no it isn't. <laughs> oh. They're just all separated by plastic, probably so they don't stick together into one big lump. Okay. This is gonna be the test. It's dehydrated watermelon. See, this is way thick, so I wonder how thick these slices may be like that thick before they dehydrate the Oh you're saying because that that's dehydrated fruit. Mm. So they had to be pretty big pieces mm. before they put they started. Mm. No go good with this. I like it. Mm -mm. Dehydrated jackfruit. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's good. I'm glad it doesn't taste like Jolly Rancher watermelon. Well, Jolly Ran Jolly Ranchers is just candied watermelon flavor. I know. That's good. Mm -hmm. Would you get it again? Mm -hmm. All right. So out of all the stuff we got, if you had to rate, which is the best one? Cookie nut, cookie butter. <laughs> <laughs> we might have created an addict and you can't do that. Next would be the apricot preserves. Those are my sweet, those are my order for sweetness and then the watermelon. Okay. So for sweetness, I would say cookie butter, even though I didn't want to like it. And second, <laughs> I would say watermelon and then the jam. So we're first number one. Now, for the savory, you've already said the seaweed over the, mm -hmm. over the. Mm -hmm. I would chips. say the seaweed. And if well, I had to choose between these two, I would say the green. I'd say the green too. And this sauce, what you dripped on my leg, is burning. <laughs> Good thing it only hit your knee. Yeah, it's burning. <laughs> All right, so, again, what is your favorite Do thing? we have to rush you to an emergency shower? Should we take the camera? No, we're good. <laughs> perfect. He's a perfect. <laughs> All right, so what's your favorite thing, again, life. at uh, Trader Joe's? And or if there's a if there's another specialty shop, um, we're get, we got to make another trip back to Pirate O's. That that I know is in the video somewhere behind, but um, there are also localities. If there's one specialty or cuisine deli store at your place, let us know. Yes, talk to so, us. So rock on from flirting, flirty and a little bit She's dirty, dirty. Talk to you guys later. I got the last word. Bye. Bye. Adios. Sayonara. Good Au revoir. Keep pushing. <laughs> okay. Bye.